Before I get into the video, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and give me a like. It helps me out immensely. Thank you for your support. Hi, I'm Clara. Today we'll continue the introduction of tool. Last week we have finished the locate tube front end. If you haven't checked it, please click the video up here. Estimate time will make predictions on the processing time of current file based on the layer parameter setting and the file parts. Click Start. We can see there will be results on the estimated time of cut, move, peers. We won't talk the center method today. We'll take a complete video to introduce it the week after. Please don't forget to come to my channel next Friday. Square Rectangle Profile Offset. It allows us to correct offset on single surface. For example, we need to cut a 5 by 5 mm square at the very middle on the current top surface, whose width is 60 mm. After cut, we find the small square is a little offside to the left. Let's imagine the drawing is the cut. After measurement, A distance is 26 mm, B is 29. Now we can apply the square rectangle profile offset. Click it. In this interface, the top surface should be the A. Based on the values, if we need a small square at the middle, both distance should be 27.5 mm. So we can input 1.5 mm here to ensure the middle. Gas DA adjust is in demo, so I cannot enable it. Let's take a picture for reference. The premise for this adjustment is there is gas proportional valve. If there is only one proportional valve for oxygen gas, here it will show oxygen. If there are two proportional valves, we can choose which one to cite. Actually, it's not a function for customers. It's used to adjust the proportional valve, which will be done in factory before the machine leaves for us. The only reason we'll meet this function after is that we need to replace the proportional valve. There are 10 parts here from 0 to 10 volts. We need to get each DA output to its actual pressure. Cycle task is a function to display machine motion without laser beam, like in the show or for customers, or cooperate with automatic loading and unloading with PLC. Click it, we can make an option, set the time in an interval. Save troubleshoot file when we meet some problems that we couldn't work them out. A professional engineer is needed. We can save the current problems into a file and share it with engineers for help. Click Save troubleshoot file. A file will be saved at the desktop so that we can share it. Simulate enables us to simulate processing of the current file. The bar here is capable to adjust the simulating speed. Advanced Tools Real-Time Monitor It will sample the command location speed, feedback position and speed, torque feedback, instruction deviation and z-axis position every second. There are four signals for monitoring. We can choose the atoms. The time could be 5 seconds to 20 minutes. The signals will be displayed in each monitoring. The default to display those four signal curves is in demo, so I cannot get the curves. Let's get the picture. Select Y1 or Y2 at the bottom to display the unwanted signals, or we can zoom the specified curves in limits. Real-time monitor 2, we have more flexible options here. 
We can choose signals and axes, enable or disable. The function is commonly used to check some problems. Path conveyor actually is the motion control error measurement. It's not enabled for all. Like the circle test, we can check whether the circle is rounded enough. We can click draw circle, start the sample. Here we'll get the max error if there is. Neo Motor Tuner is the trajectory error analyzing tool. It contains a single axis test and XY co movement test. Axis test is mainly used to check if the servo inertia ratio is correct or static torque is normal. XY co movement test can check the difference of instruction in encoder feedback when processing rectangle and circle path. Loop test enables to set the parameters for machine test. It's usually used in factory when the machine is finished installation. Coordinates viewer will show the machine current coordinates. Set current position as the mechanical origin will take the current position of cutting head as the origin. X, Y, and B are set to zero. Please apply this function with extreme caution. Interferometer program needs a laser interferometer to carry out the function. Create CD test file enables us to create a test file. We can make some quick sighting here. Tube loading assist will cooperate with a loading system if there is one. Repeated edge precision is a test for the height controller to check whether the controller is qualified. Square profile precision will allow us to check the tube shape and its difference from the ideal tube. It will be applied when there is alarms on the tube size. 